spread the forage, Mr. Matano. Ah, excellent. Now we move on to step number three. Dilute one liter of molasses with three liters of water. Very right, Mr. Maspidi. the diluted molasses onto the chopped forage as evenly as possible. Then turn and mix the forage repeatedly as you go on to make sure it is spread evenly. Then what do we do? You weigh that mixture of forage and molasses before putting it into the plastic tubing. If you're the one to weigh it. You know, you can also know the weight by putting it into those two sacks. <laughs> two sacks of... Uh, Molasses is usually 50 to 70 kilograms. But you must also have a 2.5 meter long plastic tubing that is also 1.5 meters wide and is of 1,000 gauge. Like the one I bought in the shop. Hey, hey, good. <laughs> you know, second hand ones uh, and the weaker gauge might burst during the process. But with that one, you can recycle by turning it inside out and using it again. So how much can one bag store? Uh, a 2.5 meter tubing can carry something like 350 to 420 kilograms. Then after that, it is simply putting into the bag and compacting and repeating the process. Why do we have to compact it? To, to remove as much air as possible. That way, the forage mixture will not rot. It, it ferments very properly. You have almost finished your first bag of silage. Have you left a, a foot at the top of the bag? Uh, yes, I think so. Now, tie the plastic bag tightly, ensuring that as little air as possible remains at the top of your silage mixture. And how do we store it? Uh, store away from direct sunlight or rain. You might also want to place some weight on the tied sack e.g. a stone to maintain the compacting. And that's it. Your silage will be ready to feed the cows within 21 days. And the silage is all they need? I know. Ah, the silage will also need to be supplemented with concentrates like dairy meal and minerals. And feed it to the cows at least two hours before milking or immediately after to avoid tainting. With those few words, let's meet again in the dry season as we feed our cows on silage and make a killing from increased milks.